Hello, and welcome to our video on time management skills for sales. As a sales professional, time is your most valuable resource, and how you use it can make or break your success. In this video, we'll explore some tips and strategies to help you manage your time more effectively, so you can focus on the most important tasks and close more deals. Part 1 The Importance of Time Management. To begin, let's talk about why time management is so critical for sales. As you know, there are many different tasks that go into making a sale, from prospecting to lead qualification to close the deal. But not all of these tasks are created equal. Some are more important than others, and if you don't allocate your time wisely, you might find yourself spending too much time on less important tasks and not enough on the ones that really matter. For example, prospecting and lead qualification might take up a larger percentage of your time than actual selling. But that doesn't mean you should ignore the other tasks. It just means you need to be strategic about how you allocate your time and plan accordingly. Part 2 The Most Important Sales Tasks So, which tasks should you focus on? Well, that depends on where you are in the sales process. Let's take a closer look at each stage and the tasks that are most important. Prospecting This is the stage where you're identifying potential customers and reaching out to them to see if they're interested in your product or service. The most important tasks at this stage are Researching potential customers and understanding their needs. Creating a targeted outreach plan. Reaching out to potential customers via phone, email, or social media. Lead qualification. Once you've identified some potential customers, it's time to qualify them and determine if they're a good fit for your product or service. The most important tasks at this stage are Conducting a needs analysis to understand the prospect's pain points. Determining if the prospect has the budget to buy your product or service. Identifying decision makers and understanding their decision making process. Sales, this is the stage where you're actually trying to close the deal. The most important tasks at this stage are Creating a tailored sales pitch that addresses the prospect's needs Overcoming objections and addressing concerns Closing the deal and securing the sale Part 3 Tips for Time Management Now that we've identified the most important tasks, let's talk about some tips and strategies for managing your time effectively. Prioritize your tasks Use the pie chart we looked at earlier to identify which tasks are taking up the most time and make sure you're allocating your time based on their importance. Prioritize the most important tasks and focus on them first. Use a calendar, whether it's a physical planner or a digital calendar, make sure you're using a tool to keep track of your schedule and deadlines. This will help you stay organized and make sure you're not missing anything important. Eliminate distractions, sales can be a distracting job, with emails, phone calls and other interruptions constantly vying for your attention. Try to eliminate as many distractions as possible so you can focus on your tasks. For example, you might turn off your phone or email notifications during certain times of the day to remove distractions when you are working on something important. Prioritize tasks based on urgency and importance. Use the Eisenhower matrix to categorize tasks into four categories, urgent and important, important but not urgent, urgent but not important and neither urgent nor important. Block time for specific tasks, allocate specific blocks of time for tasks such as prospecting, following up on leads, and administrative work. This helps you stay focused and avoid multitasking, which can be counterproductive. Use technology to your advantage, use productivity tools such as CRM software, email automation such as MailChimp, and scheduling apps such as Trello or Basecamp, to streamline your workflow and save time. Learn to delegate, if you have a team, delegate tasks to them to free up your own time for more high-level tasks. You could even hire some freelancers from the job boards or subreddit to free your time. Take breaks and recharge, taking regular breaks can actually increase productivity and prevent burnout. Use your breaks to recharge and come back to work with a fresh perspective. A cup of coffee is always good at certain times of the day. By implementing these time management strategies, you can maximize your productivity and efficiency as a sales professional.